Hello everyone, this is Lamin Sane of LS Web Apps and in today's video we're going to be starting a new series which is uh, a PHP jQuery validation using Ajax. Okay, So um, I've done some um, validation um, tutorials here on um, YouTube in the past but um, they've all um, been on the server side so basically you create a form and you submit the form and it goes to the server side and um, does some validation there and then return um, the results for you okay but we don't want that we want that when we submit the page uh, jquery handles the form data and then goes submits that to your server the server returns back for you some validation uh, messages and then that's displayed okay so that's a much better experience for the user right so stay tuned we're going to be creating a simple jquery plugin and then um, we'll use that to submit to the server side and then do our um, validation through that method all right so just to demonstrate to you what we were building so here we are um, i've set up a simple form form it says name email and password so we're going to be validating um something just simple um you can extend it but um to keep this video you know like concise and understandable i'll just make it simple but um when i say um simple i don't mean that you um can't do anything complex with it um if you've watched this video and you understand it you can easily add extra validations to it okay so that's what i mean by simple just gonna do a few validations all right so the name basically um has to be uh, required all the fields must be required and this has to be an email and um, the password will put in min and max length all right so right now let's submit it as it is all right as you can see it went and um, it didn't submit to the page basically what happened was uh, an ajax request was sent and then jquery received the um, results back and then displayed it for us like this okay so um as you can see it says name is required email is required and password is required so let's fill in the name um let's put in um some name there so uh, let's say uh joseph All right so i'm gonna submit now as you can see now the validation for name um has disappeared because now name is valid All right so now let's say email let's say joseph okay so now when i submit it is required so we've passed in um, some data but now it says email must be an email type all right so now let's say joseph at um, gmail.com now submit now as you can see everything is working fine okay so um lastly let's just put in some data here so i'm gonna do a uh, one two as the password not very secure but um let's just try it out so i submit it says password must be at least three in length now let's put in a password of length three i submit as you can see now it says valid all right so basically this is just a callback that i'm passing in i'll show you the code quickly um just a callback that i'm i'm passing in here and basically what's going to happen is um the plugin will accept giving in a anonymous function which you're going to actually write the code there what happens when the form is valid okay so i'm going to click ok and um let's put in some uh, password that's over 10 in length now when I submit, it says password must be at most 10 in length, okay? Now let's take that back to something that's like within 3 to 10 and now submit and everything is valid, okay? So now to take a quick look at the code, basically um, this is how we are going to use the code. We select the form and we call our plugin instance on it, alright? So in this case jQuery validate and then we pass in the URL, that is which server has to um, receive the values and then um, validate for us. And next let's do valid callback all right so basically um when the validation passes this is where you're going to write your code maybe redirect to some page or do some other thing which is specific to your application okay so with that out of the way let's start our tutorial and um, we're going to do that in the next video right, thank you for watching i hope you're excited i'll see you soon cheers bye bye